Welcome to our Financial Insights series. Today, we're diving into the CPSE ETF, exploring the latest news, upcoming events, and providing a comprehensive analysis. The CPSE ETF has been a topic of interest with a remarkable 65% return over the past year. This performance is attributed to the rally in PSU stocks, particularly in the energy sector. However, it's crucial to note that the CPSE ETF has seen volatility with significant drops in certain periods. Investors should mark their calendars for the next tranche of the CPS ETF, which offers a public opening with a 3% discount. This event is a pivotal moment for those looking to invest in a diversified portfolio of PSUs. The CPSE ETF is currently showing a neutral stance according to most technical indicators. With a 52-week high of 94.97, this level acts as a significant resistance point. Analysts predict an additional rise of 10.58% to 13.81% by the end of 2024, with potential targets ranging from 104.24 to 107.28. On the fundamental side, the CPSE ETF boasts assets worth 39,197 crore and has a very low expense ratio of 0.05%. The fund primarily invests in government-owned companies, reflecting a very high risk profile as per SEB's riskometer. The ETF's portfolio is heavily inclined towards large-cap stocks with a significant presence in the energy sector. The CPSE ETF presents an intriguing opportunity for investors seeking exposure to PSU stocks. With its recent performance and the upcoming discounted tranche, it's an option worth considering. However, the inherent volatility and risk profile necessitate a cautious approach. Stay tuned for more updates and analysis in our next video. Remember, investing in ETFs involves risk and it's essential to consult with a financial advisor before making investment decisions. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more financial insights.